We are a family of six living in a 36 foot RV while we tame this mess and create a homestead for our family. <laughs> hey guys, it's Friday night, it's raining. <laughs> And we're uh, we're picking up some stuff. We've got some friends of ours that, <laughs> yeah, some friends of ours that moved, and they gave us a bunch of their um, really nice things, like a, a swing set, um, and they've got some pergolas and a really good um, deck that's got some really good wood. So we're gonna salvage that and repurpose it for our farm. So this is what Jim's been working on a lot of evenings after work. He'll come, he'll take some of the deck boards apart, um, just working on it little by little. Um, the guy who bought the house is an investor and wants it all gone anyway. He was just gonna call a trash man. We've got a good relationship going with him and we're doing some work for him so he doesn't have to pay for it. Win-win. So we got the tin, which is quite a lot of tin and it's in really good shape. So we can use that, plus the pool, is it's an easy um, set up and take down pool. I'll have to empty the water out of the pump. We'll grab that and we'll be good. And then pretty much just finishing the deck boards, getting, I have like three deck boards left and then I'm actually getting the actual structure. So we're that close. All right, let's go work in the rain. There's the deck that he's got almost completely taken apart. And here's the pergola. It was really nice with the tin on it. And this is gonna make a great cover for the washer. Get them down. There comes a point in time when you say, 
I don't care about cover because I'm wetter than I could ever ever be anyway. Just rain on me. Jim Bobby, tell us how you feel as you sit in the rain, taking pergolas apart. It's very dangerous work. Hold on, hold on. Gonna do it. I'm not afraid. <laughs> I'm not afraid. <laughs> it's very dangerous work. You got to do it. We face hypothermia. We could die. But we're gonna do it and we'll have pergolas. These are wild pergolas. We're not dramas. We're not about the drama. We get the real deal. Look. We are wet. <laughs> like sopping wet right now. My shoes are squishing. There's it's no very need. uncomfortable. There's no need to add drama I to our lives. Being wet, by the way. <laughs> I mean Cold and wet are two things that I think I hate the most. But like like all my military friends say, embrace the suck. It's all in the mindset. Yeah. That was the last one. Of course it is. It's not coming, it's like coming out. Right. It's just turning. Right. And it's the one on the It's all in the mindset. Thank you again, Justin and Susan, for giving us this cool stuff that you feel like you have. It took about three hours to load these pergolas in the rain with all of the complications, but we finally got the things done and were able to get them home and ready to put together again to shelter our washing machine. What we got? A blue-tailed skink! Look at that blue tail. We saw him on the tree. He's really pretty. They're good to have around. They're very fast and very hard to catch. He climbed all the way up, 15 foot up in the tree. So we had a big stick and we got him to come back down. And then we, we got him, huh, bud? We worked yeah, together. Yeah, I want to hold him now. Okay, be careful, because he can bite hard. <laughs> I'm holding him. You're holding a blue-tailed skink. Yeah. You're yeah. on your way to being a zookeeper. Yeah. And I take care of the reptiles only. Yeah, you would only be in the reptile area? Yep, and I feed the skinks and all of that. Yeah, what do skinks eat? Bugs, right. like normal lizards, because he's a type of lizard. Right, Justin? Yeah.
With the pergola up and the area raised and leveled, Jim then worked on putting on the tin roof so that I could get my first load of wash done. Now that is a beautiful sight. We're going on an adventure today. So Jim did the last push to get the pergola up, the washing machine set up, and I was able to do the first load of laundry at our new place. It's out here catching the morning sun. Hopefully it'll be dry before I pack. Welcome to the mess. Welcome to the mess. Where God takes our mess and makes it his best. Yes. Magic videography.